Final thing about Lenny Scales and Arpeggios it is cumulative. Don't be deceived into thinking it's modular. You know, um, I did, well, I did B minor for uh, grade four, but I've got that now, and I'm going on to grade five, and there's no B minor in grade five, so I don't need to practice it anymore. Um, you do. You need to keep drilling all of them, because the idea is to build up your secure knowledge of all of them over a long period of time. I have heard people say, why did you pass on all three pieces? They can't fail you for the exam. Examiners are told this, provided you attempt the rest of it. Um, and so some people say, so just don't bother about skills, it doesn't matter. But that way it gets you nowhere, because you're not going to develop any technique. You need to build this up as you go, because it is your, your, your means to developing, to build up all your technique. And when you get to advanced level grade exams, or advanced repertoire, you're dealing with a lot of fast moving passage work. Um, sometimes very chromatic or in, in um, a range of different keys. And if you haven't built up that technique, you're not going to do it. You cannot play fast semiquaver passage work with fingers like a bunch of frozen sausages. So proper teaching is guiding you through the whole process of learning uh, uh, all the way along, which is what makes us unpopular.